guys. That was a great win by uh, Rote Capelle over Own Alliance, a really good al um, alliance that exited the tournament already. Uh, we have plenty of matches to go. They are all exciting. Next up is La Chuna Romana, one of the teams that traditionally does really well versus Hydra Reloaded, uh, one of the tournament favorites. Before we go to that and before we speak to our uh, good guests here in the studio, I think we should take you to the commentators. It is Kill2 and Darius Johnson, and I believe the lovely Stevie SG is with them. Yes, hello, Sandro. I am Stevie SG, and welcome to the lovely commentary booth. I am here with the guys who commentated the latch, last match. I've got the lovely lead expert, Kill2. How are you doing, Kill2? I'm really good. I'm totally overwhelmed. I didn't know my mic was live earlier, and I started talking about my family and friends, and then we had a crazy match that I didn't really understand, but I'm very excited. Well, I'm glad you're excited, and I have uh, the incomparable Darius Johnson. How are you, sir? I am wonderful, Stevie. That's good. Did you enjoy the match? I did very much. I'm pumped. Are you? Oh, that's, that's yes, good to know. I, I think that set off a good, a, uh, a, if that match serves as a, a barometer for how the rest of the matches are going, I think we're going to have a wonderful weekend. I have a feeling we're going to have a pretty good weekend. Anyway, I'm going to be your correspondent for the next couple of days. So if you have questions for these lovely guys, head on over to the forums at eveonline.com. There's a little forum thread um, by me which says questions for the commentators, and you can post your question in there. We like limericks and poems and things like that as well. And I'll get it to these guys. You can also join us on Facebook. Uh, that We've got a lot of stuff going on on Facebook. And we've got Twitter as well, in case you can't get to a television at some point during the weekend. Um, we've also got a, a little thread on the forums about posting how you're watching the tournament, uh, which is pretty cool. If you've got a big flat screen TV, if you've got a lot of friends around or you're having some sort of party, we want to see your pictures, so post them. And we are celebrating this tournament with a big competition, uh, which is being sponsored by some really awesome guys, NVIDIA and Eon Magazine. And it is the Guess the PCU competition, which means what we want you to do is to guess the closest to the peak amount of players on the server on Sunday the 20th of June, which is tomorrow, which is expected to be between sort of 19.30 and 21 GMT. So that contest is now open. So what you need to do, if you think you know how many people are going to be online, send an email to CCP PCU Comp with only the five-digit number you guess as the peak in the subject. So there's an example there. You only have one entry per character. That's going to be checked. And the closest two guesses without going over will win. If there's more than two valid entries, the earliest one will win. And the winner, which is pretty awesome, gets one NVIDIA GTX 280 graphics card and issues 1 to 20 of Eon Magazine, which is huge. And the second closest get guest gets oh, an NVIDIA graphics card as well. It's pretty awesome prizes. So good luck to you guys. Get guessing. And uh, we look forward to seeing who's going to win that. So I think that's it from me right now. And we'll be back later on. And uh, over to Soundwave in the studio. Thanks very much, Stevie, and the guys uh, in the back room. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the match. We had uh, one of the ships that's, that's popular as a supplement, the Hugin. Uh, for people who don't understand why people only like bring one and what it does, uh, Angelhan, wh what is the Hugin good at? The Hugin, like its brother, the Rapier, is one of the, if not the best, webbing ships in the game. Um, it's, ver it's very nimble, has a solid, solid weapon system, but what it's really going to be brought for is range control. Um, with its command, with its recon ship bonus uh, at level five, and a uh, command module, uh, I believe it's skirmish, skirmish warfare, um, that will bring the range up to about seventy kilometers, uh, in which you can control any single ship with double webs, uh, from which is essentially nearly half the arena. So it's a really impressive ship. Uh, it's not expensive as far as points go, but it's very versatile. Okay, that's great. Uh, we did want to talk a little bit about the Golem and how they match together. Of course, uh, the, the, the webs are a little bit important in that manner, but uh, we do have the next match ready. It is the, uh, one of the best alliances in the tournament uh, whose name we constantly mispronounce. I'll give it a go now. It is Lashuna Romana. I hope I got that one right. Uh, versus Hydra Reloaded, one of the tournament favorites. Let's have a quick uh, roundabout on the table. Who's going to win that one, huh? Uh, Romanian Legion. I'm going to go Hydra Reloaded. Diagoras? Um, Virginia Romana. It's a pro little pronunciation there. I, I like yeah. it. Um, I think I'm going to go with Lashuna Romana as well. But uh, let's, let's find out. 